despite the so far good news surrounding ABA, there is still a sense of drift surrounding CP implementation with direct implementation, a direct implication for resolving the crisis in Darfur. The uncertainty surrounding elections provide a good example. The contested census, large-scale displacement and volatility, particularly in the area bordering Chad, create enormous risks that the people of Darfur will not be in a position to participate in the electoral process. This will further disenfranchise millions already disempowered by conflict. It has been more than five years that the Council addressed this crisis. While the situation on the ground has changed, we are, many, we are in many ways no closer to a solution now that we were when the issue was first taken up by this August body. This is deeply distressing because of the human suffering that has occurred in the intervening years. It is also deeply frustrating because the elements for a solution have in many ways always been clear. There being no objection, it is Dialogue must become the only serious options. The arms and financial support must stop flowing. The safe havens must disappear. Until there is sustained progress in each of these areas, we will not see a solution to the crisis. Instead, we will continue to meet in this chamber to discuss an apparently intractable situation. And the chairman of the Foreign Relations Committee. Thank you.